Bride is a beautiful actress. She's an American legend. Her show, Franklin and Bash, is on Wednesdays on TNT. Take a look at this. I'm Carmen Phillips. You're hard to get a hold of. Yeah. My phone burned up when our house burned down. She lives with the Franklin and the Bash. Oh, is that a long-term plan? I don't know. Does it matter? I hope not. I need you to do some digging about Juliet Morano at Capstone. Capstone, yeah. Um, I'm more comfortable in, like, bars. I'm more comfortable in St. Bart's, but I work here. Heather Locklear, everybody! You like my horse? It's not a real horse, Heather. It's... It doesn't look like it has horse parts. Oh, it has? Oh, it has horse parts. Parts of it have horse parts. Oh, okay. Hooves. Oh, oh. That's... Do you keep horses? No, I don't. You don't? Have you ever been on a horse? Yes. Do you know any horses? Them. Go oh, them. You mean him? Him, I meant. Yeah, yeah, not them. There's only one of them. Right. Did you ever go to Disneyland, pull the heads off Mickey Mouse, Heather? What the hell? Help yourself. I am. I'm super friendly, sorry. You, no, that's great. I love attractive blonde women who are super friendly. That's kind of my thing. It is. Good. Yes. It's nice to see you. Thank you. It's nice to Congratulations see you. Congratulations on nice the... Nice to meet you. Yes. I, well, actually, I met you before. No, you didn't. Yes, I did. <laughs> you were Tell a little, me. uh, you were a little drunk. Shut now, up. Tootsie Fruitsie. <laughs> no, it was at the Drew Carey show. I used to play Drew's boss, and you turned oh. up once, and I was like, I had a Okay, I don't recall, but... No, I know. I, I made a huge impression on you that day, I remember. <laughs> no, but I remember you were there. You were oh, uh, with I'm a very sorry. attractive friend of yours as well. I can't remember who that was, but, um, oh. yeah, it was like you kind of waltzed in, the pair of you all smelling like awesome, hot, rich women. I thought you were going to say horses. No, you didn't smell like, well, no horses I'd ever met. <laughs> I, uh... I suppose there are expensive, rich horses that smell nice, but I don't know any. I don't think so. What perfume are you wearing? It's really lovely. Um, can I tell you? No, don't say it, because a woman should keep her secrets. I can tell by using my fingers, though. Use your fingers. No, 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 I, I, I mustn't. Okay. You are super friendly, though, I aren't you? Yeah. The Franklin and Bash show. Who are you playing in this? I play Franklin and Bash's boss, and she's just trying to corral these two crazy lawyers and um, and be bossy to them. Are you I mean, are you the ball buster? Well. Yes, a little bit, maybe a little bit. Means... Yeah, a little bit. A little bold. bit, but yeah. not really in a playful way. I like I'm friendly. that. Friendly. You are friendly. I'm kind of shocked how friendly you are. I, don't people take advantage of you? Uh huh. <laughs> Tell me about that. <laughs> Are you in therapy? Uh, not yet. Not now. Let's pretend I'm your therapist, all right? Okay. All right. Would you like me to be Austrian or just from here? <laughs> just from here. All right, then. I'm an Austrian who moved here, though. <laughs> So, Heather, tell me why you are so open and friendly with people. Why are you so friendly with people? Um, because people are friendly with me. Ah, but not all people have your best interests at heart. Some of them could be agents or managers. Oh. <laughs> and they're back in that green room. Yes, they are. And do you know what they're doing back there? They're looking through your purse, Heather. Not just taking a percentage. No, they're taking whatever they want from you. Maybe that's just in my life. <clears throat> You've been working in Hollywood for a long time. You've probably got someone good. What do you mean? You know, an like an agent. Yeah. I thought you meant a therapist. Um, well, do you? Well, I have yeah. a little of both. Yeah, yeah. No, you have to. I mean, what was the the, uh, the show that I loved you on? Was T.J. Hooker. Remember that T.J? That was quite you. That little uniform. You never yeah. saw that. Show. Yes, I did. <laughs> I still watch it now. I'm on like on the internet. <laughs> <laughs> Yes. That's creepy. That's my thing. I'm the creepy foreign guy. Uh, okay. Is it creepy to have watched your show? I mean... Well, to go on the internet and do what is... Well, people go on the internet for much creepier things than watching reruns oh, of yeah. T.J. Hooker. I mean, T.J. Hooker is like one of the softer elements of the internet these days. I think you like William Shatner. I love Shatner. Do you and Shatner get along? Yeah. 
He's really fantastic, he's isn't he? He's funny. I know, yes. he's very funny. He grabbed me once inappropriately. <laughs> right here. On the set? No, right here, on my junk. Oh, right there? Yeah, yeah. Oh. <laughs> the front, not the back? It was kind of... Like that? It was kind of all around. <laughs> it was like an octopus. <laughs> He's very, very funny, though. He's he is. Very He's very funny. lovely. He's Canadian, you know. Yes, I do know that. Yeah. Have you ever been there? Yeah. Been uh, William Shatner? Yeah. Or Canada? <laughs> Wherever you want to tell me, yeah, that's all good. You guys were great together. You had very good chemistry on that we show. Did. That's all I'm saying. The last time I saw him, I think I was at, I think it's still called Hogs and Heifer in New York. Oh, yeah, I know that. Take off your bra and put it up on the thing. Well, I did. You did? I said, should I? And he goes, yeah, take it off. He was with his wife. <laughs> what, was he on the phone? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, take it off now. <laughs> take it off now. Send me a picture. <laughs> no. Now, Locklear, is that Scottish? It sounds like it may be a Scottish A little name. bit. Is it? A little. Have you ever been to Scotland? No. No, you should go. They'd like you. Okay. <laughs> Gosh, you're very accommodating. When are you going then? What? When are you going to Scotland? Uh, this summer. <laughs> You're just making things up. <laughs> Aren't you? You can't go this summer. You're doing Franklin and Bass. No, I'm finished. Oh, it's really? A show. Oh, you don't do it live? What? <laughs> I don't know much about TV. <laughs> what do you do for July 4th this year? I'm um, barbecue. Really? Mm -hmm. Do you like the smoked meat? Do you smoke the meat or do you. What is going on? No, it, it's, it's not that. It was that Jeff and I were talking earlier on about smoked meat, and that's why, because, and it was a kind of a, I, I'm not in Smoking any... Smoking meat? <laughs> sort of. You know, you get, you get meat and you, you smoke it to add flavor, like barbecue oh, flavor. okay. Oh, okay. Well, how do you prepare your no, meat then? No, I don't. I don't cook. Well, well, you just hang around, wait for somebody to... Yes! <laughs> I'd do that for you. Right? Yeah. Yeah, I'd, I'd cook anything you like, anytime. I would let you. Yeah, I bet you would, yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, we're out of time. That's it. Okay. Have a